Good morning, I'm Janelle Burrell with your morning digital news brief for this Wednesday, November 15th. Detectives were hoping to learn more from surveillance video after three people were shot at a South Philadelphia bar. This happened just before 9 o'clock last night at Merrily's Cafe at 7th in Oregon. More than two dozen shots were fired both in and outside of the bar. The Central Bucks School Board has voted to approve a six-figure severance package for its outgoing superintendent, Abram Lukabaugh. The decision outraged a lot of community members who attended last night's board meeting. Lukabaugh, who resigned on Monday, did not attend. And with just about a week to go until Thanksgiving, the Chester County Food Bank is working to prepare holiday meals for thousands of people struggling with food insecurity. This year, the need for food has gone up, but donations are down. If you would like to help, the food bank says any donation of food or money will be appreciated. Let's get you caught up on our next weather forecast as we look ahead. Good morning to you, Kate. Good morning, Janelle. We've got a pretty nice November day underway. It is seasonable right about where we should be after a chilly start. We're warming up to the mid-50s this afternoon. Today, though, more clouds rolling in this afternoon, though it's not as windy as yesterday, so without the wind chill, it'll feel pretty nice. It does cloud over this afternoon, but get ready for a gorgeous day tomorrow. If you have some time to get outside, tomorrow's the day to do it. A beautiful, mild Thursday. And you know what? Friday looks pretty nice as well. At least for the first half of the day, we'll see sunshine. It's warm again with temperatures in the upper 60s, but then it starts to come crashing down by the end of the week and the weekend. So today, again, above average in many spots. We'll get to right about average in Philadelphia, 56 degrees, increasing clouds, seasonably chilly today. You can see the clouds in place right now, and clouds are going to thicken as we go into the afternoon as a weak disturbance moves across the northeast. Doesn't have enough moisture to produce precipitation, just extra cloud cover. For tomorrow, we're looking at sunshine all day long. Friday is another nice start with some sunshine in the morning, and then, well, it all comes to a crashing halt. Friday night into Saturday morning, showers along the coast from a coastal low, and then a cold front sweeps through Saturday morning, bringing the chance for showers, followed by another push of chilly air through the weekend. So your next seven days from next weather, again, a nice little warm-up through Friday, but turning cooler over the weekend, best chance of showers comes early on Saturday. Janelle, I'll send it back over to you. All right, thank you, Kate. And remember, you can always get Kate's up-to-date forecast and the latest stories here on cbsphiladelphia.com. That's the latest for your morning digital brief. I'm Janelle Burrell. Have a great Wednesday.